Hello, everybody. As you know, I was working on index cards last week. Now, because I didn't have the um, index cards today, I just used um, scrapbooking paper, which was tea dyed, so it's ready to go. I tested glues out today. The school glue, which is Elmer's school glue, I don't know yet how it will work. I'll have to tell you after. I don't think it's as good as um, PVA. My favourite is really this one, Craft Glue. It's got a quick setting formula, and I think that's why it works so good. See the um, school glue, it's doesn't seem to be giving me that sheen and all that so I'm thinking that's not going to work. PVA glue, yes yeah, seems to work but we shall see. I don't know if you can see them. It's really hard working on this angle. But, so what I'll do, we'll go test out um, my other one and see. I always use, because um, I'm going to squeeze the bottles tight, I've got to do it this way. So I am going to use the craft glue again, since I've done the other two with the other glues. And I see a bit of lift there, so I'm pretty certain the craft glue is better. So, I lather it on. And I ink well, and again I'm doing... Um, something like index cards but instead like I said it's um, cardstock or leftover see coffee pages that she whoops I always have accidents with glues whoops. see normally you can just put a little bit on a plate and it should go a long way but yeah I was in a hurry anyway it is what it is it will work in my favour actually, and I want to put lace down. And I just feel these dry so much better with this particular glue. Okay, dokie. Again, I go for paper. I love my ink dyed paper. Um, there. Yeah, I just love ink dyed. Um, pages but you can do anything with them um, I don't think I want to use that I'll use some other scrap as I said what I do op shopping thrift well we call them op shops here thrift store shopping is where you're going to get your bargains so I want to just find some piece with I guess I've already got some cut. Yeah, I've already got some cut. So fish store. Um where's the other thing I was using? This loves fish store. See? Fish store bargains. And then you just cut into it. I was gonna coffee dye this but I didn't have a chance. It's a waste of weight, isn't it? You don't get a chance. So again, I am going to place that halfway across my writing. If you're using a brush, it'd pay you to have a jug, a little jar with some water in it. I haven't got no water in it because I plan to do a few more. Now, I know this glue will actually set and stick everything down. The other one, it's doing it. But it's not, whoops, you went to the wrong one. It's not as good. So you can use magazines, you can use um, scrapbook paper, you can use all sorts of things for this sort of decorating and whatnot. I always run the glue over the top because I like the way it finishes off my page, you know what I mean? Now, um, like I said, these are just scrap paper, I mean scrapbooking paper. 
it only go to waste if I don't use it in my journaling. So I find it's best to use it. See, there's a little bit of lift with the PVA and it's not setting like I like, like it to set. It might though. I'll just put a bit of um, my um, craft glue on top. I think it's because it's on top of lace, I don't know. But anyway, I want it to work. So, so basically i done that in the school glue and there seems to be a little bit of lift, but I'll see how it dries because sometimes you can use a glue and there'll be a bit of lift, but you still get that um, nice finish with the glues. This is the one I've completed. I completed that one with PVA glue, which you can get really cheap at Walmart, I believe. And with this one, this was used, this was PVA, but I put a bit of craft glue on top. Now, um, like I said, the school glue is up for questioning because I believe, yeah, it's sticker down paper and it stuck me lace down, but it hasn't stuck me jump down. See, this is last week's one and it dried beautifully absolutely beautifully so if you haven't got index cards you use your um cardstock i think this is yes. i'll just get it this is three so you can cut them three by five. Three by five and it gives you the size of the medium index cards. There's actually smaller index cards and there's actually um, bigger ones. Um, I actually prefer doing a bit of colour because I don't believe that's got enough colour. So it's a matter of hunting around here and finding a scrap of colour, which I'll have, that I can add to break that up, or I can find a word, you know. I don't know how good that's going to finish, but anyway, I just thought a bit of colour might break it it's very bland and maybe if I do find a word I don't know if I've got a word here that would be good for it oh happiness that would do you can see I haven't cleaned up from last week because I'm always working on here so I tend to um, do all my inking and everything in one spot. Oops. I'm just safe making a mess everywhere else. And I do make a mess everywhere else. Believe me. Maybe across that blue, since I put that there. So I don't know if you can see what I'm doing, but anyway, I will show you. I didn't ink it as well as I should have. But the beauty is you can go over it with um, your ink slater. Damn, I don't know how good that looks, but at the moment it looks better than it did. So yeah, that's drying out well actually for P PVA glue. And that's PVA with a little bit on top of the craft glue. Alma's glue is this one. I don't know. It might dry all right. I just feel it's got that wetter consistency. You know what I mean? So it's harder to... Anyway, but these are my journaling cards for the week. I thought I'd keep 
doing a little bit on journaling cards because you can use all sorts of things. As you can see here, I cut up some bit of scrapbooking paper, a bit of um, words from an old book, and happiness is in the moment. So that's what I actually done with mine. Um, like I said, I'm still questioning the fact about this glue. It's hard to know. Hard to know. Look, school glue, I think, is not good for me. PVA can work to a certain extent. And I'm just wondering if this, this is as heavy as the index cards. Actually, yeah, the weight's the same. So it'd be about around 160, no, 120, I reckon these are, in weight. So would these in, in the stock, around 120 or 40, something like that. But that seems to be working well. And same with that one and that one. me done for today don't forget to put your lids on tight these are super duper cool glues I like them actually I think I've got the wrong lids on each one <laughs> they would have knocked me around because you know what would have happened they would have dried out and I wouldn't have been happy with that because my experiments are glue at the moment because Mod Podge is so expensive. So there they are. Like I said, that's the school glue. That's the PVA. Oh no, it's not. That's the craft glue. These two are PVA. And that's got a bit of um, craft glue on the top. Because I, like I like the fact that the craft glue actually dries um, shiny and I can see by the school glue it's not sticking like I would like it to you know if I hold it down it might but do I really want to waste time holding stuff down when I can get this done a lot quicker and do heaps of journaling cards quickly anyway thanks for watching hopefully you could see what I was doing